my experience, my experience in Nashville was spectacular. Um, because there uh, I was um, moving nonviolence to help people see that they could um, engage in what was extremely militant behavior, <laughs> walking into uh, restaurants and, and uh, stores in downtown Nashville uh, and sitting where they were not supposed to sit uh, and asking for service. And as that purpose of the workshops unfolded, you know, lots of people became very fearful, afraid they could not do it. But the astonishing thing is that the group of people I met in those first workshops were folk like Congressman John Lewis, 18 years of age, Diane Nash, J uh, Jim Bevel, Bernard Lafayette, C.T. Vivian, Marion Berry, Angelina Butler, uh, Pauline Knight. Uh, those are some of the names I remember clearly and we, we, we have remained friends. After the first sit-in, they came back What's the word? Um, exulting in the fact that they sat in and their fears were vanquished. And that, for me, strengthened the notion that what is new for us often does frighten. But if we can muster up the will to do the right thing and try it, then the action will confirm within us the, the, the essential powers that we need to continue and to, and to do it. So action, in fact, helps us to become new people more um, radically than thinking does. The talk and the thinking are all critical, especially for evaluation and knowledge uh, and, and intellectual development, but it is the willingness to step forward and act that really confirms you in a different way of life and a way of thinking. <laughs>